Kim, that's exactly what happened. And you can imagine the kind of chaos that would have ensued at this apartment complex when a man simply hopped into a vehicle with two children inside of it and just drove away. Well, tonight, as you mentioned, we're hearing from a man who literally stopped that vehicle from getting out of this complex. Now, this all started as an Uber delivery driver stopped here to make a delivery at this complex, something that happens day in and day out every day, right? Well, she says she left the car with her two children inside for just two minutes. Well, police say that's all the time Andrew Colvin needed to steal the car with her five and 11 year old sons inside. The mother desperately calling for help started knocking on doors and we spoke to a man who answered and realized that Colvin would have to drive back towards him in order to get out of the complex. And that's when this man sprang into action. Well, I threw my shoes on and I ran out there and then we just, the mother was like trying to she was like, that's the car, that's the car, and uh, just ran up to the car and opened the door up and tried to get him out of there. I really was just thinking about, like, how so many times you see about these kids getting taken and, like, you kind of wish you were there. And uh, that was just really what I was thinking, seeing the mother, and I was like, oh, we need to help her. Help her indeed. And in fact, those two children unharmed despite everything that happened. Now, as for Colvin... Police tell us it turns out he was actually out on bond after being arrested two weeks ago in the same general area on a charge of prowling. He was arraigned earlier today. He's now facing a handful of new charges, including kidnapping. And police say this is all a powerful reminder to make sure to leave your cars un or locked rather and never leave them unattended, as was the case here. Live in Nashua, Stephen Quinn, 